the instructions are always the same. Focus on your breath. I've heard people complain, when are we going to focus on other things? Well, you will find there are other things that you need to focus on from time to time. When you're dealing with lust, when you're dealing with anger, there may be specific meditation themes you need. But the breath is home base. You want to get to know it well. And the best way to get to know it well is to go back and forth, back and forth many, many times. Like a bus driver who has one route to the city. After all, the driver begins to realize slight changes here and there. Notice it's not always the same every time. Sometimes it's very much the same. Nothing new happens. But the fact that you're familiar with what it ordinarily is alerts you when something has changed. What's going on in the mind? There will be subtle differences. And the more familiar you are with the breath, and the the better you know them, and the better you're able to recognize those differences. And John Lee has different teachings where he shows how all the wings to awakening, the Buddha's basic teachings, relate to the breath. There's the breath in the four establishings of mindfulness, the breath as it relates to the five strengths and five faculties, the seven factors for awakening the Eightfold Noble Path. You can see all of these factors in the breath if you look carefully enough. So the breath provides you with the raw materials that you need, and simply your attitude that you bring to it, and the fresh eyes of your alertness that you bring to it every day. And John Fu had a student, a, a nun, who had health problems, and he told her to use the breath as her way of giving yourself a physical checkup every day. And again, you can, use, you can do that only when you're really familiar with the breath, as it goes to the body, how it ordinarily is in different parts of the body, and then when something is out of whack, exactly what is out of whack. And sometimes a pain may be in one part of the body, but the cause of the pain is someplace else. So I want your awareness of the breath to be all around and very detailed. Think of Mark Twain when he was learning how to be a steamboat captain. After his very first day, the captain had been telling him at every bend of the river, this is what you have to watch out for, this is what you have to watch out for. And at the end of the day, he asked him, okay, now tell me about the bends of the river today. And there were dozens and dozens of them, and Mark Twain was taken aback to realize that he had to memorize every one of them. His, de his knowledge had to be that detailed. Well, you want your knowledge of the breath in your feet, the breath in your hands, the breath in your head, and you want it to be detailed too. Because then when things go wrong, either in the body or in the mind, you'll have something to compare. So this is where things normally are, and this is when they're abnormal. So put in the time. Put in the effort. To get really familiar right here. And do your best to Train yourself you don't get bored with it. After all, it is your body, it is your mind. They're constantly acting right here, and, and you have the chance to watch them carefully and having, instead of having to have lots of duties that pull you outside. And if you're bored, it's just that you're not looking carefully. So try to be alert. Try to be careful in how you observe these things even though there's a lot that's going to be the same from day to day. Every now and then something will show up, and that's what you're looking for. It's like being a hunter. You have to be very patient but very alert all at the same time. If you're impatient, you start making noises moving around, scare off the animals. If you're not alert, the animals can come up and crawl all over you and you don't notice them. So you need the right combination of stillness and alertness, patience and clarity of vision. When those become constant, 
That's when you'll be able to see things clearly for what they are. <laughs>